install Ubuntu Linux, or you get pre-installed on a computer from, say, Dell, it ships without support for playing back proprietary media codecs. What I mean by proprietary codecs is stuff like MP3, Flash, and DVD. These are all formats that are restricted somehow, either by patents, licensing, copyright, or DRM, or even are illegal to distribute in some countries. They would prefer you, you to use open and free codecs, such as Ogvorbis for music or Theora for video. These non-free codecs, however, are in widespread use today and are supported on many devices. So if you want to use your computer for any media-related tasks, chances are you're going to need support for these restricted formats. This may change as soon as, soon as Ubuntu 10.10, .10, uh, Maverick Meerkat, as Canonical, Ubuntu's parent company, has already announced that they are licensing H.264, which is quickly becoming the video standard on the web for inclusion in Ubuntu. Likely MP3 will follow, as it is required to use the Ubuntu One Music Store, and I wouldn't be surprised if they also include support for Flash uh, to complete the out-of-box experience. Today, we will look at how to install these codecs on your Ubuntu Linux 10.04 Loose Links computer. These instructions will also work for previous releases, such as Karmic or Jaunty. I just stuck a DVD in here, and when I go into uh, open with, mus with Movie Player, as you can see, it's not going to play. Same thing happens if I go into Rhythm Box and try to play something um, and same thing try to go to YouTube and play a video here now they all give me a prompt install missing plugins search for suitable plugin search for suitable plugin you can go through you can do that all one by one uh, what I'm going to show you today is how to install them all in one go so first thing you want to do is go to your Ubuntu Software Center, do a search for Ubuntu Restricted Extras. As you can see, this installs support for MP3, uh, other formats, Microsoft Fonts, Java Runtime, Flash, uh, DVD Playback. However, note that, let me get this going. that it will not play encrypted DVDs. Those are commercial DVDs, so any movies that uh, you're going to buy, most DVDs don't come unencrypted. Uh, the matrix that I have in here is definitely not one. So let's wait just a moment while this installs. takes a while because it's installing support for a lot of codecs at the moment. A lot of packages and dependencies that it has to download and install. this notes it doesn't install support for encrypted DVDs or commercial DVDs. So we've got one step left to do here. Press Alt F2 on your keyboard to get the run dialog. And in here type gk sudo forward slash user forward slash share forward slash doc forward slash lib dvd read for forward slash install dash css dot sh you're not going to get confirmation because uh, that should be done in a terminal to see what's going on, but it takes just a moment. Now I can go in and watch my movie. As you can see, I no longer get that dialog asking to install plugins. to go in <coughs> and I can play some
music now. If I open up Firefox. Now the Flash content plays. So nice and simple, but it was an extra step required in order to get that done. Like I said, in future releases, uh, that's probably going to be eliminated uh, to improve the on box experience and to get Linux installed on more desktops uh, without having a lot of people complaining about not having support for these. So, I hope that video helped you out. Thank you for watching.